Hey YouTube, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing great today. Happy Easter Monday if you guys celebrate Easter. Um, and if you don't celebrate Easter, then just happy Monday. Hope you have a great start to the week. Welcome back to my channel. This is week 19 of my life in California. Thanks, so thanks for rejoining me. I can't believe I've been here for four months already. How crazy. Uh, for those of you that are new here, a welcome. Thanks so much for being here. Um, I'm basically Dr documenting my journey of how I moved from the UK to California and I've been here 19 weeks which is crazy so yeah welcome back let's do this <laughs> morning so far. I've edited my Paris vlog, posted some content and I went live on my Instagram to talk about, because I've been here four months now already, how crazy is that, a third of a year. So I went live on my Instagram to talk about my experience so far, things that I've learned and all that sort of stuff. Um, so for anyone that got my YouTube link through that and is now on this video, hey thanks for uh, joining me on this journey. Um, I'm about to have an egg, sausage, spinach wrap and smoothie for lunch whilst watching Outer Banks. Where is it? There it is. My little sister got me into this when I was back in the UK and I was like, yeah, I'll watch an episode with you, I'll humour you, um, because she's, she's obsessed with it. And now I'm actually quite obsessed with it too, so. <laughs> Just off to the gym. I'm just now taking Mavo for a walk, um, but my tattoo's getting a bit itchy, like the plastic like film on it is getting a bit itchy, so I think I'm going to take it off tomorrow. I've got the afternoon off tomorrow because it's my friend's birthday, so we're going into the city. Um, yeah, but I'm going to take my, my film off in the morning, I think, because yeah, it needs some moisturiser on it now, my little tat. Good morning. So I just took the seal off my tattoo. Oh, let me hold the camera so you can see. Well, that's a really, really good angle, isn't it? You see, took it off, nice and fresh. I love it. Oh, you can't see. That's not really good for a second. been pretty quiet this week um you know i was just pretty chilled out yesterday at the festival Ooh. i love this new sweat sweater <laughs> so cute and then yeah i've just been just been just not really done much to record but i'm going to your 70 tomorrow and i'm just packing now but the thing is it gives so it gives snow tomorrow night i guess it's warm tomorrow day but then in the night it gets cold because like it's, it's in the, you know it's in the valley and it just has extreme temperatures and because it's still April, it does give snow tomorrow night. So I've, I'm taking a woolly hat, taking my woolly hat, and I've got like a selection of jackets, ones like fleecy ones and like to keep me warm and waterproof. But then on Saturday, Sunday, when we're going hiking, it gives like 18 degrees Celsius, so it should be really nice for hiking. And hopefully, there's not too much snow up high. Um, so yeah, I'm kind of like taking a selection of stuff because I'm driving anyway, and then I can just leave stuff in the car and whatever. Um, I've got my trainers and then my winter boot kind of walking boot things i don't have hiking boots um yeah let's see how it goes but my friend carmel who i met in canada um when i lived there well i lived there from 2015 to 2017 so i met her there in whistler and she still lives there she's got a residency now lucky um yeah she's flying down to see me i haven't seen her in two years last time i saw her was um my birthday in New Zealand uh, when she flew me to the airport um, and I flew home because I had to fly home for lockdown so that was fun. The answer since then 
Um, so yeah, it's been over two years now and I'm really excited to see her. So let's go, yes, Emma T? Well, today hasn't started as it was meant to. Um, I was meant to be going to Yosemite today and I was up all night with a stomach bug and diarrhea. So yeah, that's not been ideal because I didn't really sleep and um, I don't feel that great. I don't feel sick. I think I just must have ate something. I don't know, but it was not, it's not been great. Um, I slept, I didn't work this morning in the end. I said to my host family, I've not, I've not, I'm not able to because I was on and off the, in and out of the bathroom every five minutes. Um, then I managed to sleep for two hours just now without any interruptions. Um, and I've woken up and tried to eat some food. So I, I had a bagel and I've just got a bowl of fruit and some water. And if I can keep it down in a, in a, you know, nice way and it not, it not come out grossly, then in a couple of hours, I might think about going to Yosemite with my friend. She's currently in the city. She came, she flew down from um, Vancouver or Whistler, Vancouver, Canada. That's where I met her. Um, when I lived there and I haven't seen her since we lived in New Zealand we both really lived in New Zealand at the same time together and she's from the UK so anyway um, I'm gonna let her know in a couple of hours how I'm feeling if this food doesn't go bad and then we'll go from there but I was like what a bummer literally I've, oh, a bit annoyed but anyway happy earth day people let's hope that I can still go to see some amazing mother mother nature earth in Yosemite today um, and not be stuck in bed all day because that's not what I want at all so luckily I'm feeling much better, so we decided to come, we're on the road, just had a quick toilet pit stop, but we're on the road to Yosemite, and I'm really excited, and I've um, been having a great catch up with my friend who I haven't seen in two years, so yeah, feeling good. Thank you Bonnie for agreeing with me. So we are about 15 minutes away from our hostel, this is my friend Carmel, uh, and we're going to get some groceries from the store, ready for the weekend. I have to take on the phone to the bank, and then you can come to the I'm just going to give you a quick hostel tour whilst no one's in here. This is our room. It's got 12 beds, but it's only actually a six bed because they're not having some of the beds because of COVID, I believe. Me and Carmel are down the end with all our food, ready to make our dinner. I've got top bunk because I'm such a nice friend. And then, I haven't actually been in here yet, so it could be terrible. Oh, bathrooms. Showers. Not awful, not awful. Okay, that will do. Dinner prep. We're just having hot dogs because we got the password. And spinach dip because I love spinach dip. So last night was a disaster. I thought I was feeling better. But then last night after dinner, dinner, uh, after dinner I felt fine, a little bit like my stomach was a little bit ruined, but nothing too bad. But all of last night, I think I slept for like an hour and then I woke up and I was consistently on and off the toilet, like just coming out of me. Disgusting. Um, yeah, not ideal. So hardly slept and I feel really bad because I come out to go on a big hike. So I might just have to sit in the valley while she hikes by herself because I have no energy to hike whatsoever. I don't, I don't want to eat anything for breakfast in case it all goes wrong again. So yeah, not the ideal situation. And also this morning, um, I went into the bathroom after being in and out of there multiple times. And this uh, this guy is talking to Car Car Carmel while she gets ready. And he just turns around to me and goes, are you struggling with nausea? And I was there like, <laughs> oh yeah, it's kind of, kind of both ends actually, you know. Uh, excellent, Carmel, thanks for telling this really sexy English doctor, it turns out, that I am um, shitting myself. Thank you for that. So, um, but then when I found out he was an English doc a doctor, he was like, oh, I've got some uh, anti-diarrhea and anti-sickness tablets. And I was like, oh, you are amazing. So yeah, he gave me some. Um, so hopefully I feel okay, but I'm not going to eat anything yet because I just don't want to push it. He said, don't eat anything yet. <sighs> so that's fun. I've been up all night, no sleep, and then mortified in front of a very sexy English doctor. So it's going well so far. Take me out to California Take me out to California I feel the day is coming to an end And my eyes are drawn to southern skies And all the while I was trying to pretend The promised land was there beyond the great divide 
Carmel's going to go do the hike that we're both supposed to do today. Um, Vernon, no, Nevada and Vernon Falls. I want to sit in the car and try and nap because, yeah, my belly's not okay. I definitely can't hike right now. Um, it's nice to be here, but it's half day. But, yeah, I can't, I can't hike, so I'm going to sit in the car and try and nap. Seeing I had no sleep last night. But one of my friends, who's also no pair, is I've just seen her Instagram story and she's here. So I, might, maybe, might, I might get lunch with her, but, um, yeah, it's sad. Sad times. I want to hike. Okay, so I managed to nap a little bit in the car. Um, it wasn't the best, but it was a bit, little bit. But then some lady woke me up because um, I think a car had moved whilst I was napping and another car pulled it next to them. But like they, they'd pulled over like quite fast. There wasn't, there wasn't quite room for another car. So this lady woke me up from my nap. Like, oh, can you move your car over a little bit, please? And I was like, fine, whatever. So I did, so she could just get her car in. Um, but now I'm just gonna go, do, go on a little explore because Carmel said she'd be back in about an hour and a half, so. I'm just gonna explore around this area and wait for her. I've seen it all upon the silver screen. The happy face is then a sign upon a hill. The wine is flowing, the moon feels forever green. And all your hopes and dreams will always be fulfilled. So I'll be coming, coming real soon. As you just saw, the actual like viewpoint of the falls, it's so busy. We're, we're here in April, right? It's not even the height of the season, but it's so busy. So I like hiked round to the right a little bit. It's like a little rock face. And I got pretty amazing views. And it's just me here. I made it back to the car after my little solo explore to the falls. Um, I'm glad that's all I did because to be honest, my stomach the whole time was like bum bum So yeah, I'm glad I didn't push, push myself too far and do like an actual hike and then have to like cripple over in the bush no thank you um and now i'm just having some crisps to try and eat something hopefully my stomach stays okay um and a man on my on the wall was like i love your shirt and i was like oh thanks hun literally shen it's it's like a baggy just purple and black baggy shirt and i honestly love it it's great also, we're staying in a retro caravan tonight and I'm really excited to go there and I'm really excited to show you it because it looks super cool. So I think after this, when Carmel gets back in about 10 minutes, we're going to drive to the other side of the, of the National Park. We have to go out that way uh, to get to the falls, um, to get to the, not the falls, to get to the caravan. So yeah, we're going to go through that, that way, get some more pictures and then head to the caravan, have a nice chill evening. Yeah, it should be fun. So take me out to California where the sun is always high. Where the streets are paved with gold And no one ever gets old I'll be longing for that day Till you come and take me home California, California Here I come So this is our home for the second night <laughs> Is it cute? Sorry, look Oh wow, that's a bit loud. Yeah, Where's the bed? So I'm currently just dying on the sofa slash bed of the caravan. I haven't moved, haven't moved for like an hour, just not feeling 100%. Um, and Carmel is outside stretching on the balcony after her lovely hike that she did today whilst I sat and napped in the car. <laughs> Yeah, Carmel's cooking his dinner because I'm not moving from my spot because I don't feel good. So mummy is making food, aren't you mummy? In our caravan. In our caravan. That's loads of room to move. <laughs> Carmel found some uh, pet in our... Uh... <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I know. Dinner is served by the amazing Carmeli. She got. She gets wine, but I don't want any wine because I will. She's no, sick. no. 
comfy in my bed in the caravan, so I'm ready to go to bed. This is my little, my little bed and that's where my caravan's going to be. <laughs> so last night was another disaster, it was not fun. I bought some more tablets for myself and I bought myself a nice lolly to try and just stuff on that and not eat anything because everything I eat comes out of me. So, not fun. We're trying to go to the park again today but I literally feel weak as shit so we're just regrouping and seeing what to do this morning. Makeshift cheeto holder with pasta sauce in it that we just, we just ate. Mm -hmm. Onwards. I am now an official Californian with my Californian license. Okay, back from the crazy, weird, but fun weekend. Um, I'm, I'm sad that I didn't get to do any of the hikes, but yeah, my stomach just wasn't okay, so it's what it is. Now I'm attempting, well, I had some toast earlier, butter, and it was fine. I wasn't, I slept all night last night, so I'm attempting like a late breakfast of beans on toast with mushroom. So hopefully all goes well, it stays down well, properly, and we're back to normal. But I've taken Carmel to the airport, and then once I've eaten this, I'm gonna clean out the car, because it's a bit muddy. Fingers crossed. I'm not gonna lie, that food has made me feel a little bit gross again, so well, I can't do this, it's not okay. But anyway, this is the end of this video because it is now Monday and um, this video ends on Sunday usually. Um, I just wanted to update you on the stomach situation because I know you're all so interested. So thanks for watching. I'm excited for this week, it's gonna be good. This weekend is looking good too. I am working, but we're doing some fun stuff whilst I'm working. Um, we're going to a sports game in Vancouver, so that should be really good, so stay tuned for that. I'm not gonna tell you what it is till we get there, because it's a surprise. Um, but yeah, that'll be fun, like a family outing. Um, so take care guys, see you on the next video, and thanks again for watching.